What precisely is the total performance engineer's problem today? Well, you might put it this way. Back in 1903, a man named Barney Oldfield drove Henry Ford's 999 racer an astounding 60 miles per hour. Going like 60 is still heard round the world. Sixty years later, a Ford-powered Lotus race car tools around the Indianapolis Speedway at a blistering average speed just under 150 miles per hour. In this hurry-up world of expressways, turnpikes, and superhighways, the engineer concerned with total performance has problems that lie somewhere in between. There's no Barney Oldfield at the wheel, and there's no Curtis Turner. There's just some guy named Joe and his family. They're headed who knows where or when. In any age, the automobile is the product of its time. To build a car that can be driven safely and satisfactorily by anyone in the world, and that anyone can afford to own, this is the engineer's goal, the constant challenge for total performance.